What's up, YouTube? Silver Garden is back at it again with another video about silver. If you like silver, you're into this kind of stuff, please give me a thumbs up. If you like the video, subscribe to my channel. And in this video, I'm going to be talking about junk silver, you know. And when I first started stacking, um, I stayed away from junk silver. I was like, no, I don't want that. It's, they're cheap. Um, the junk coins, you know, I'm like, they're dirty. I was like, I don't want that one. The shiny stuff on it, bars, silver rounds, you know, it's because they would look so nice. But after a while, once I found out about the history of these coins and I bought my first one, I was like, I felt like, no way, man, these, these coins are actually pretty cool, you know? When I found out they were 90% silver, 10% copper, I'm like, that's pretty good, you know, because you get 90% silver, you know, it's pretty much almost all silver and 10% copper. And copper still a, a cool, a good metal, you know, so it's not like it has zinc or nickel or anything. It's just 90% silver and 10% copper. You cannot go wrong with that, you know. And then I bought some of these some silver half dollars and I'm like wow these are amazing coins you know silver just look at how they look on the side it's all silver it's not like bronze or copper on the side you know and then I bought one of these silver silver dollars look this one's in BU that means that it was never circulated I mean, look at this coin, man. Do even they don't they do not make silver dollars like this anymore? Not this size. Look how look how big this dollar is. Just compare it to a quarter. Look, compare this silver dollar to a quarter. You know, even to a half dollar. You know, like, that's big. I mean, just look at this coin, man. Eighteen eighty six. Wow. That's when I was like, whoa, man. Junk silver is cool. And that's when I realized I was like, man, look at this one. 1921. That is thick. I mean, just look at the difference. A quarter and one of these silver dollars. They did not make silver dollars like this anymore. And that's a piece of history. That's when I was like, I like junk silver. I was like, this stuff is cool. It's great. It's neat. A coin tells you a lot. You know, look, this one's been circulated. This one over here has been circulated more. You know, you're like, whoa, these are cool. So if, if you guys have a chance to pick some of this stuff out, pick some of this stuff out. I mean, if you got a little bit of money, save your money. You know, if you, or if you got some money already, use that money to buy you some of this. You know, you're not going to regret it once you have it. You know, and you know what you got, you're going to be like, you're going to be glad you bought this. You know, you're just going to want to hold on to it. You're going to want to buy some more, stack some more for your future, you know, because this, this is valuable. This is real money. You know, they do not make money like this no more. And, you know, its value is way more than it's face value you know what they say it is and um it's way more than what coins are today the new newer ones they made so i mean just buy some you know buy a little bit buy a row if i were you guys i would save up 250 bucks and buy yourself a row of a ten dollar face value either half dollars or quarters or dimes and once you have it i think you'll be hooked and you know, you like collecting this. Look at this, Liberty half dollar coin, man. This these ones are awesome. Half dollar, nineteen forty three. Yeah, these coins are awesome. Yeah, pick yourself up some of this. You won't regret it. Anyways, that's all I got for now. Peace.